I guess what the, what's been the focus, I guess, the bye week? What, what's the main thing you guys have just been focusing on? Uh, just, just refocusing, um, just getting back um, healthy. Uh, getting everybody mental right, you know, mentally, physically, just getting back right. You know, just, um, like I said before, re-engage and refocus. The key to do that, um, to have these have a very strong final four weeks, what, what, what's the key to that? Oh, the key is just um, to get back mentally and physically back fo focused, you know, and just do what we do best, honestly. So, yeah. How uh, would you just reflect on looking back on what you, your performance up to this point in the season? What are the things that you've liked? What are the things that you want to kind of improve on? Uh, things I can improve on. I want to improve on. Uh, just keep being a leader. You know, um, in, in tough times, when adversity hits, just keep being a leader. You know, uh, being a leader, you know, it's like one of the hardest things to do, one of the hardest jobs. But, you know, when you made for it, you made for it. I don't want the guys that made for it. Because a leader sometimes need help himself. You know, and when guys on the team <clears throat> need help, you know, you have those guys. You know, it's all about just the bond in the team. And when the bond's strong, you know, everybody have each other back. You know, everybody don't have to take a lot of barriers or barriers or anything. So, you know, just keep being a leader and just and just keep just keep fighting for real. The opportunity to play Penn State, um, what what's what have you seen that seen on film and what kind of challenges do they present? Uh, you know, it's a new week, new opportunity and you know, they're they're a good team, you know. Uh, nothing we, we, we faced them before, you know, and we just gotta go out there and play, play, do our job, uh, play in the end of football, and just do what we do best. Is there anything different about them just because of personnel? I mean, it seems like they've obviously got a lot of talent running back this year. In particular, do they uh, function yeah. any differently than you're used to seeing? Well, they usually have a lot of talent for real. Mm -hmm. You know, um, we just gotta go out there and play our, our game. You know, it, it is a good football team. You know, give them the credits. It is a good football team, but you know, we're a good team also. We just gotta do our part. Yeah. We do our part, I'm pretty sure everything will take care of itself. What have you seen the difference, I guess, when you guys, as a defensive unit, play well? Like, you, you guys only allowed 10 points in the first half to Michigan. Um, you know, that difference to, like, the Maryland game the last few minutes where you gave up a lot of points. Like, what do you see as the difference between when you guys are playing well and when you guys aren't? Oh, the difference is just you, got, you just got to do your job. I mean, a defense like a puzzle, you know. If one puzzle is a piece missing, like, things ain't going to go well. But the whole puzzle is together. Things gonna be, the, piece, the puzzle is going to look good. So, you know, you just got to be consistent. Uh, that's just for real. Just be consistent. You know, if you're consistent, things look like the first half of Michigan. You know, if you're inconsistent, things just going to look like, like you said, Maryland. Uh, kind of going back to that, uh, you guys haven't kind of struggled getting takeaways in a couple of, you know, past couple of weeks. Um, what do you guys got to uh, do to get, kind of get back to, your, to, to those, those ways? You got to punch at the ball more, uh, rake at the ball. When the ball's in the air, you, know, you got to um, grab them. You know, you just you have to create opportunities because the offense just ain't, oh, here, here go the ball. So you just got to rate, just assess over the ball, you know, in any form, shape, or fashion, just be assessed over the ball. Do you feel like it's a case of the opportunities for those plays have been there and you guys just kind of need to take them more or just kind of bad luck and it just hasn't fallen your way? Uh, we had a few opportunities. The ball was on the ground. You know, we used the wrong, we used the wrong technique to get the ball while it was on the ground, you know, and and that's that's like, that's like on us as players. Nothing to do with the coaches, nothing to do with anybody. As an individual, as a team, we know when the ball's on the ground and if it's a lot of people around it, it's a certain technique you have to use. And, we wasn't using those techniques to get offense the ball, so that's like on the players for real. What is that technique? What's I, I, uh, I guess I hadn't thought about there being a technique when the ball's on the so, ground. Like what, what do you guys? So if you buy on like a whole bunch of people, it's called the city, mm -hmm. and the ball's on the ground. You have to catch the tip, tuck, and squeeze. Mm -hmm. You can't roll it back. You have to catch the tip and uh, squeeze the ball. Mm -hmm. And like, if you just out in open field. Mm. You have to put your fingers tips and um, pinch it together and mm. scoop the ball up. That's the country. That's when nobody around. But when it's a lot of people around, you mm. have to catch the tip of the ball and tuck it and squeeze it. Okay. And we wasn't doing that. What is it like just to see Cam have to deal with the injury being out? Um, and it seems like he's continued to be a leader, but just to see him kind of go through that adversity. Uh, it, it, it hurts, you know, that just an individual but bigger than football, you know, he's he not playing the game that he loves. You know, obviously we'll love Cam out there. You know, he's a big puzzle to the team. You know, but we have guys that stepped up. We have um, Ace, you know, Matt Holt, you know, BJ, 
you know, those guys been playing their tail off. Uh, you know, Aaron Case has just been a heck of a linebacker for us. You know, and he don't get the credit he deserves. You know, BJ been playing his tail off. Even Matt Hope, as a young as a young guy coming in, you know, playing his very best. And I'm pretty sure you guys see him out there making, filling the gaps, making great plays. You know, we have backers that's doing their part. You know, we'd love to have a counterback. And when that time do come, you know, it's just, it's, One more. he ain't going to miss a beat. Anything else? I'm good. Thank you. <laughs>